Okay, before I go inside, I want you to look at your neighbors. There's the one on that side. I'm kind of standing in the front of the house looking at the cul-de-sac. Homes on both sides of you are very nice. It's a nice cul-de-sac. Quiet. Very nice. Very nice. Roof looks like it's in good shape. I think. Got a little uh, little front porch thing here. See this? A little uh, front porch. Uh, the floor is going to need work. They're all terrazzo. Most of them. So you walk in the door. I'm right at the front door. Over to your right is the I guess that's a family room kind of thing that goes out to the pool. Huge family room right here, very open. But before we do that, I'm gonna to go to the left and we're gonna go down and go to the bathrooms and the bedrooms, okay? So you come down a hallway here and what you basically got is you got four bedrooms and a bath, each with this door. So the first one, here's bedroom number one, window, Basic closet, nothing uh, exciting about that. I know it's got some built ins there though. It does have some built ins in that one. That's bedroom number one. Uh, then we go to the right again, and this is the bath. There's the flooring. There's your realtor again. And it's complete with a toilet. Bath looks like it's in decent shape. So that's the bath. Here's bedroom. This I'm going to stay on the right side, so I won't confuse you. Okay, so this is the, the also turning right off the hallway, and this is the master. It's not real big, but it's big enough. It's got a carpet that you're probably going to want to replace. It's got some nice windows. And terrazzo again underneath this carpet. Uh, and then this one does have its own bath. It's not a very big bath, but it's enough. A little purple there for you. And walk-in shower. There's not a tub in here, but the bath itself, the shower itself, looks like it's in very good shape. Um, there's the flooring on the tile, those small checkers. And now I'm coming out of bedroom number two, which is the master. And you go directly across the hall. Here's bedroom number three. Terrazzo again, those windows. Oh yeah, I think this is it. I think this is it, Sydney. Um, and then, oh, this is good size for a spare, a spare bedroom. This is number four, and it's pretty decent size, actually. Um, typical closet, I assume. Yeah, once again, a few built-ins there. So you got four bed, and then we come straight across the hall and we're back to the bathroom that we went to earlier. So I'm backing out now. So you have, just a quick review, bedroom number one on the right, the bathroom on the right, the master bedroom number two, directly across now I'm on the left side of the hallway, bedroom number three, and bedroom number four. So everything's all over here, all the bedrooms are all together. Coming back out towards the front door. Now I'm turning around once again. Now I'm back at the front door like I'm just coming in the house. If I go straight ahead, you go down this little ledge right here. Where's this little ledge? Little ledge right there. And you have this very large, very nice open um, family room. Very large, very nice. And then you have a little step up here, and you can see that step up needs a little work. Some flooring, the flooring needs work. Um, nice window, so this is your dining room area, and you have a little step up. And then you come to the kitchen. And the kitchen is not updated, but it does have an, I take that back, it does have an updated stove, flat top stove. Um, here's your cabinets above the refrigerator. I'm on the right side, and if I pan around to the left side, more cabinets, window over the sink, more cabinets there. So I'm going to back up and get that again for you. Um, 
Here is the kitchen. That's a galley kitchen, but it's not as claustrophobic as that last one uh, because you got doors on both sides, not just one, and you have a nice window out to the pool. So when you come through the other side of the kitchen, then you got a second family room. And I don't know, you're going to need to replace this carpeting, but the family room, this is a second very large family room, for lack of a better term. Uh, then we'll go out to see the pool. Now you got a, it looks like, if you look down on the, on the ground here, around here, it looks like they had one of those side rooms, like we saw in that last house. Like a, you know, you would screen this in as, a, as its own room. And then from that room, you would come out and screen the pool. The pool is not screened, but it does look like it's in decent shape for what I can tell. So here's the pool. A good size yard actually for a pool. I mean, on a cul-de-sac, you got a pie-shaped lot. And so coming, I'm coming around the back of the pool now. And I mean, this is all dirt, but you could sod all this and everything. And this could be a nice back area. Got a broken down shed back there. But it's all fenced with a, most of it's six foot fence. This is all six foot. It's just down on that neighbor's yard over there um, that uh, is not. So now I'm at the pool and I'm looking back at the house. Okay. So like I said though, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna keep panning right around. You have a very nice yard. I mean, it's, it, it needs work, it needs sod, it needs water, etc. But it's very nice. Um, once again, I'm looking at that roof. Uh, I think it's in good shape. Looks like it is. Okay. Um, okay. And then you got this funky little room out here in the back. First, I thought this was a second bathroom because I couldn't find it. But I eventually did find the second bathroom. But this is just a storage room, I guess, for pool supplies and floats. And it's got a few shelves in it and that kind of thing. And then this is the door into the garage. Two-car garage. It's been vented over there for the, for the uh, dryer. Got a couple of shelves here. Nothing big. Nothing very exciting. That's just a, a wall. There's nothing there. That's the other side of that little room they made. So, oh look, we've got some cabinets over here in the garage. But, uh, yeah, so you know, basically storage stuff. Okay, I'm going to close the outside door to the garage that goes straight through. Turn to my left, and I'm coming back through that second family room with the carpeting that needs to be replaced. It's got a nice window on that side, and it's got windows on this side. So this is not going to be a dark area. It's going to be, it's going to have light. And then you've got these, uh, what is this, I guess? This, I've got a, got a closet here uh, off of the family room. Um, I guess you could use that as a pantry because I don't really see a pantry in the kitchen, you know? But if you just walk around the corner through this little family room, that's probably what they were using that for, I would imagine, would be a pantry. And then if you come back through, now we're back at the front door. And this is your view out the front of the house. I think we ought to move on this one, Sydney. I think this is it. So once again, I want to so just because I, I think this is it, we're going to walk through it again just in case I missed anything. Okay, so I'm at the front door. And this is going to be quick because we've already done this once. So we you come down to the left. You come down. Here's this long hallway here. And immediately to the right is bedroom number one. Second door on the right is the bathroom. Third door on the right is the master bedroom. Take another look at the, at the bath. Is there a light on in here? There we go. Um, I mean, you know, there's nothing wrong with the bathroom. Um, you got lots of windows in here. In this bedroom, in the master, you got a windows there and windows there. So this will be nice and bright. 
And the same thing, now you go directly across the hall and here's the next bedroom. Good size, windows here, windows here. Man, I hope this isn't sold by the time I get back to my office. Okay, uh, terrazzo floors. Okay. Um, and I'm going back, back out the hallway back to the front door and turn immediately right to my left is that spare that family room number two straight ahead is this family room number three which i'm guessing i mean that's a big room i mean this is good size and then plus you've got the dining room over here that kind of has this like i said you're going to want to replace a lot of the flooring and then from there you come around to the kitchen through the kitchen into the second family room with this funky carpet that needs to be replaced uh, around to the right that pantry we talked about continuing straight through you would get to the garage uh, you will be doing your uh, there is no out inside laundry you would be doing laundry in the garage that door goes straight out to the pool and then here's the pool area again um, and look at this stuff uh, I see it doesn't look bad. Uh, the pump is running on the pool. And the pool looks like it's in good shape. I mean, I don't know. It doesn't look very deep on this end. I'm, oh, I, I think the other end's a deep end. I'm at the shallow end. Okay, this is the shallow end because there's the steps. And then, uh, yeah, it's probably six foot deep over there. Not, not screened but we can get in this house, we ought to do it. Okay, that's it, bye.